the pulse energy, a combination of an average power and a repetition rate. Pulsed lasers, irradiate light in optical pulses. The pulse duration depends on the type of the laser, and can go from several femtoseconds to several milliseconds. A laser pulse is a package of a certain number of photons. The laser pulses are separated by a time interval, T0. The pulse repetition rate, F, is defined by the inverse value of the period between pulses. The unit of the repetition rate is hertz. Typically, the repetition rates go from a single pulse to several megahertz. The power is the measure for the flow of the energy. Its unit is one joule per second, which we call watt. Thus, the average laser power is defined, as the product of the number of pulses and the pulse energy, divided by time needed to irradiate this number of pulses. Since the ratio between the number of pulses and time equals the repetition rate, the average power is simply a repetition rate times pulse energy. Consider, that we have a laser radiating pulses of 100 microjoules. At 100 kilohertz, the average power is simply 100 kilohertz, times 100 microjoules or 10 watts. But, if the pulses are 10 nanoseconds wide, the peak power, this is the power during each pulse, equals 100 microjoules divided by 10 nanoseconds, which is 10 kilowatts. We see, that the average power and the peak power may reach significantly different values. At the constant pulse energy, the average power increases proportionally to the pulse repetition rate. At a constant pulse energy of 100 microjoules, the average power goes from 10 watts at 100 kilohertz to 100 watts at 1 megahertz. At the constant average power, the pulse energy decreases exponentially by the repetition rate. At an average power of 10 watts and the repetition rate of 100 kilohertz, the pulse energy equals 100 microjoules. However, if the repetition rate is increased to 500 kHz, the pulse energy equals 20 microjoules, and when the repetition rate goes to 1 MHz, the pulse energy decreases to 10 microjoules.